चांदनी दिस स्टोरी इज अबाउट अबू खां एंड हिस्स फ्रीडम लविंग गोल्स अबू खां लिव इन अल्मोड़ा उत्तराखंड विद हिस्स पेट गोल्स He treated them like his children and often talked to them. He took them grazing during the day. At night, he tied them up with a rope in his hut. Although Abu Khan loved his goats and fed them well, they did not like being tied up. They loved to be free, so one by one, they left him and went away to the hill top. Abu Khan felt sad because he knew that the wolf would eat them. After all his goats had left him, Abu Khan decided not to have any pets. But he missed living with his goats so much that he got a beautiful white little goat. He named her Chandni and shared stories of his dear friends with her. For many years, Chandni lived happily with Abu Khan. Chandni was fascinated by the beauty of the sun shining on the hills and the breeze blowing through the trees. She wondered what it would be like to run up there. She wanted to be free. Soon, she stopped eating grass and listening to Abu Khan's stories. One day. She requested Abu Khan to set her free so that she could go to the hills. Abu Khan was heartbroken. He warned her that the wolf would eat her. But Chandni was determined to have her freedom. She assured Abu Khan that she would use her horns to fight the wolf. Abu Khan reminded Chandni that one of his goats named Kalua had died fighting the wolf. Although she was as big as a deer, when Chandni insisted on going to the hills, Abu Khan locked her in a small hut. At night, Chandni escaped from a window that Abu Khan had forgotten to close. Chandni played on the green slopes all day long. She refused to join a pack of wild goats because she wanted to enjoy her freedom alone. When day turned into night, everything became quiet. Chandni heard a strange grunt and remembered the wolf Abu Khan had warned her about. She was scared, but she did not want to go back to Abu Khan. She decided to fight the wolf, and she fought him all night. When morning dawned, Chandni was bleeding heavily from her wounds. The wolf was tired of fighting and was waiting to eat her. A flock of birds sitting on a tree were witness to the tough fight Chandni had put up all night. A wise bird confidently proclaimed that it was Chandni and not the wolf who had won the fight.